Come and find me. Hannah is a girl who discovers life for the first time. And its core really is a story about children growing up and uh, taking responsibility for themselves. But in this case, she's going out in the world to kill. I just missed your heart. If you think you're ready and you want to leave here, all you have to do is flip that switch. It tells me the week where we are. She had been trapped in a forest for about 14 years of her life and had never really seen the outside world. She's been trained by her father, an ex-CIA agent, to have all the skills required for an assassin. Remember what I told you, you'll be fine. I'll see you there. So for her to step out into this world is very overwhelming and scary and beautiful and full of love and sadness. It must all be very strange for you. How long have you been in the fort? Her first mission is to assassinate Marissa Wiegler. I want to speak to Marissa Wiegler. Tell her I'll be there tonight. It was the most terrifying 30 pages of any script I'd ever read in my life. Should I kill her? Just find her. Marissa Wiegler is a CIA agent, and um, she's like the wicked witch of the piece. Ostensibly, it's a thriller about a girl who's produced by a CIA program, genetically modified to make her brilliant at fighting, and has become a dirty secret of the CIA, and they need to get rid of that secret. She won't stop until you're dead, or she is. The thing that I was really interested in Marissa was the need for Hannah to get Hannah. It's a professional necessity. quite an inspiring story actually and I think a lot of people are going to be able to relate to it because of the awkwardness and the sort of isolation that she feels. So it's got a lot of meanings, it's not just about this girl that kicks ass. I set out to make a film that really entertained but also that explored issues as well. It's a film that works on many different levels. Did she turn out as you hoped? Better. <laughs>